Hey mama, are you struggling to define your personal style? Well, stay tuned because I'm gonna give you five tips to define or redefine your personal style. To build it up for the mamas, right? All right guys, thanks. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Again, I'm Therese of Simone Lynette Styles and I am a personal stylist. I help mamas of color and postpartum mamas of color reclaim their identities and live their lives authentically and passionately through personal style. So today's video, again, I am giving five tips to redefine or define your personal style. So first things first, you need to shop your very own closet. That's right, shop your very own closet. You do not need to go out and buy a whole new wardrobe in order to redefine or define your style. There are some gems in your closet right now that probably still have tags on them that haven't been worn in a while. They're just waiting to be restyled and reimagined. Shop your very own closet first. Here's the next thing. You need to find fashion inspiration nearby, okay? Um, but anyway, back to what I was talking about. You need to find fashion inspiration nearby, okay? If that means going to the museum, if that means going downtown, taking a stroll, looking at the buildings, looking at architecture, even going to the park, looking at nature, you can create fashion inspiration just by the environment around you. So not necessarily looking at other clothes, but looking at things that are around you and how you can recreate Create that through the clothes that you are wearing so even if you are say for instance a structural person you like things to be structured a little bit more rigid you know you like them boom bam 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 type a right so you probably have more of a cleaner silhouette you like more of a polished finish so looking at buildings different um architecture things like that may speak to you and inspire you for your new wardrobe so make sure you're utilizing that fashion inspiration that you see around you and you can put that towards your wardrobe another good tip or a good tool that we have nowadays that you can use is creating your ideal personal style using Pinterest boards having Pinterest could be the key to redefining your style okay go on Pinterest see some of those ideas and visions that you have for yourself in your own wardrobe pin those on one board look at what you already have and you can be able to recreate restyle reimagine some of those same outfits using those Pinterest boards next thing you want to make sure that you have different versions of your go-to outfit for each season okay so what that means i'm going to show you real quick so i have on like these crop jeans you probably can barely see this right crop jeans Ugh. they're cropped on the ankle right so these jeans and say for instance a plain sweater or sweatshirt or top like this I can basically put this on in any season, right? Probably not so much in the summer. However, it's an easy transition to just put this on with a tank or even a cute little V-neck or scoop neck t-shirt as well. So having different versions of your basic wardrobe, right? Your go-to outfit and being able to just tweak small things for each season. Add a scarf if it's, if it's winter time. Take off the scarf, put on the tank when it's summertime. So different ways you can restyle that go-to outfit that you already have. And here's the last thing, mama. You want to experiment and have fun, okay? Dressing up, 
getting your wardrobe together should not be stressful okay you can make this a stress free time for you using style as a form of self-care by experimenting and having fun so there is a hit and miss sometimes right like we don't all get it right 100% of the time although it may look like it although <laughs> but that comes through trial and error you find your style by trying things out seeing what works for you what works with your body type what makes you feel good you're not dressing for nobody else but yourself first and foremost now although style is a tool that you can use to be able to attract things from other people or even other experiences that is not the main reason why you are getting dressed so when you experiment try something out and you're having fun maybe you've never really worn red before or maybe you've never really dibbled and dabbled on some of the darker colors you know wearing all black trying some monogram colors things like that experimenting trying it out seeing the reactions that you get and the feeling that you get how you feel inside and that's gonna reflect how you feel on the outside so make sure whatever you do you are having fun first okay experiment have fun cut your losses if it don't work mm, just know it don't work don't beat yourself up about it just try again we get a different day every 24 hours to give us the benefit to try it again so experiment have fun watch your style change up watch your life change up after that you got this mama so if these tips just kind of scratch the surface for you and you have more questions please reach out to me. You can send me a DM on my Instagram page under Simone Lynette Styles. You can also go to my website under SimoneLynetteStyles.com. You can send me a message on there. Um, I'm also on Pinterest, Simone Lynette Styles. Of course, make sure you follow, you like, you subscribe, and you share with another mama friend, okay? Also, make sure you're commenting below anything that resonates with you or any tips that you may even have or you've tried that's helped you redefine your own style. We in this together, okay? Just remember, you can also hire me as your own personal stylist, and I can help figure this out with you together. Let's grow. Let's be the best mamas that we can be. But first, we got to be good to ourselves, okay? All right, y'all. Thank you again for watching this video. I'll check you out again later. Bye. To build it up for the mamas, right? All right, guys. Thank you.